Okay, guys, I'm going to play this very short little video for you. Um, okay, he, he is standing there. This is at a North Carolina rally, I think it was. Trump is standing there, and he professes Jesus Christ as God. He stands up for Jesus Christ. Now, there's, there's a few true prophets on here, very, very few, and one of the main ones that I totally believe is a prophet is Prophetess Amanda Grace. And she said that she believes that and I concur with every bit of it. She believes that while Trump was while Trump Trump <laughs> while Trump was sick with COVID, she believes that he had a God moment. I do too, because listen to this. She said that no man is going to stand up there and profess Jesus Christ. And he doesn't just say God. He says Jesus Christ. I am old and I have never, ever heard a president stand up and acknowledge Jesus Christ. They may talk about God. They may, you know, talk about a prayer or praying for a second or something, but I've never heard one profess Jesus Christ until this moment. This is a, a really landmark thing. It really is. And so she believes that he had a God moment and God dealt with him while he was sick. And she believes that he has turned a corner and really humbled himself and submitted himself to the Lord. Now we will see. We will see how it all plays out. But I believe her. Because like she said, no person, no person with an antichrist spirit is going to stand up there and acknowledge Jesus Christ. And not just acknowledge him, but also do it so publicly I mean, here's this man, the most powerful man in the world, and he is standing up before millions and millions professing Jesus Christ. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I believe God did deal with him. Now, look, um, I know all the things that are said about him. Um, you know, I, I know everything. I used to think that he had an Antichrist spirit because I know all the things that were said about him. And, uh, you know, he's a mason, he does the hand signs, he's with the, with the, and with the elite and all this stuff. I used to think that too, up until this moment. So I believe God really dealt with him. And I, I'm with Amanda, nobody with an antichrist spirit that does not love the Lord is going to stand there in front of millions and millions of people and profess Jesus Christ. They're just not going to do it. It's not going to come out their lips because they want to give glory to themselves. Somebody with an antichrist spirit, they want to give glory to themselves, not give glory to God. So let's go to it. Let's just play it. It's only a minute long, but praise God for this. Go Trump. <laughs> Vote Trump. Okay, here we go. Let me see if I can get the captions in there. In case he doesn't speak loudly enough, what am I doing? I think I just cut him off. I'm so sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm an old lady, and I just really woke up not that long ago. <laughs> I haven't had my coffee yet. Okay, let me see. Masks, no masks, everything. You can do all you want, but you know, you still need help from the boss. You still need help from need the help boss. From the boss. That's what happened. We need help. Right. Amen. Woo! When would you hear a president say like that? Say, now they'll criticize me for that. How dare he say that? How dare he say that? No, I'll say it. I'll say it. I'll say it. Somebody said to me the other day, you're the most famous person in the world by far. I said, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. They said, yes, you are. I said, no. They said, who's more famous? I said, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Oh, this is making me cry again. Oh, my God. No, I can't. I'm not go. taking any chances. I'm not going to have an argument. Hey, I'm not having any arguments. Jesus Christ. 
I'm not going to take any chances. I'll give it, I guarantee. And let me look up and I'll say, and it's not even... No, I can't believe that. I can't believe a president stood there and said that, you guys. This is so awesome. This is so awesome. So, okay, I just wanted to show you this. I don't want this to get too long. Oh, you guys, this is so, so awesome. Praise God for that. I believe he had a God moment too. I believe God dealt with him. I believe he submitted himself to the Lord. Maybe I could be wrong. Maybe a man that could be wrong. We'll see how it all plays out. But, you know, this is the most incredible, remarkable thing to watch a president stand there and acknowledge and, and profess Christ. Oh, glory to God. God bless you guys. I'm going to go now. Go Trump.